this impassable, hard to navigate section. Um, I thought it'd be really cool if we had these very formal gateway sections so you kind of knew that you was going to get into some fruit. Districts of Lowville, we've all seen Lowville, but how do we describe this polluted cityscape? Uh, particularly in between, like where there's this uh, the big building of the, the family, how does that sit around all of this, uh, all of the cityscape around him, suffering that we've been working hard to get that scale read, right? Because that guy, uh, that building's pretty big. Uh, and then things like, you know, what type of ecosystems are going to be on that planet? It's a corporation run amok, so they'd have these huge dumping grounds and then. This starts informing, informing like the assets we're going to need, but also type of animals. Check that armadillo out. He's sweet. Microtech, you know, the domes of New Babbage. That's going to be cool. Headquarters, you know, um, they're a very high tech company. You know, what would the uh, headquarters be like? We wanted a very good contrast between this slick uh, high tech kind of dome. We've got like white mountains outside and we've got like white walls inside. You know, where's the color coming from, right? And we get into this crazy detail. So every botanical that you see in our game goes through this very uh, rigid. Uh, visual development process where we're wondering what that, what that guy is. This was a terraforming accident, so this, this, this landscape's wild. And then again, the botanicals. What would the botanicals have been like if they would have been blasted since, you know, every day they were growing, so everything would be leaning. And then going to my personal favorite, like Arzen, the floating landscapes, we've, we've, the floating lattice, we've seen this. I wanted somewhere where there's a little bit of um, a little bit of a nice landscape to kind of relax in. So from the law, you know, it's more about the recreation. So it can be beautiful to have like these gardens overlooking these vistas. So we've got a trees on Crusader. What would it be like if they grew up like high up above a gas giant? I wanted something that didn't feel like a bonsai, but almost felt just as beautiful, just from a pure silhouette. 